so the drivers now heading to the podium as we look at some of the highlights of round three of the Formula Renault North European Cup. This was the green flag lap that cost Robert Sisker a chance of running, went off into the barriers, damaged the car, and the 71-year-old American went no further. So as the race got underway, the best start made by Levin Amveig, who charged up the inside, and by taking the race lead going into Cox Corner, it was Amveig who was never headed from that point. This was a remarkable scene on the first lap as the officials got Siska's car out of the way. Stein Schotthorst was busy making up places early on, attacking Ben Barnicote going through Stoke Corner. He gained the position on the inside line. Barnicote got forced out wide. Then Schotthorst attacked Morris. Said Morris was very defensive indeed on the run down towards Brooklands. He hung on to the place there. In contrast, others weren't quite so fortunate as Max Biedemann ran off the road and then ran out of luck going into Luffield. When Schotthorst did make his move on Morris, it was a perler. Diving up the inside, there was just about enough room, curve and all. Morris had a big slide a lap later coming through Beckett's, but would ultimately spin in his battle with Barnicote. The two of them ran side by side, heading down towards Stoke Corner. Barnicote pulled off a great move to come around the outside. Wheel to wheel, they went through Vale, and then by the time they got to the loop, up the inside went Seb Morris, and there was a spin, and Morris dropped down the order. For Levin Ambeg, though, victory in race one at Silverstone. The winner by over half a second with Aurelian Panis in second place and Jake Hughes in third. There's another race tomorrow. Join us for that from Silverstone. For now, from David Addison, it's goodbye.